guest is going to be strumming and he is strumming well, he away <laughs> <laughs> he is strumming away our guest is known as feel key oh my god it's feel key <laughs> feel key <laughs> but his real name is ifiok ifanga and he's from Ibom state and he began his interest in music at a very young age in the church choir yep and lots of them have the church choir to thank for their Yes. success in music yes well i'm waiting for you to do it <clears throat> what to go into this business would you like me? you you've been in the church choir haven't yes. you yes and it's a good beautiful place to you're be. still in the church I'm choir still in the church choir well you need to metamorphose <laughs> i don't need to <laughs> few keys there uh, yes and uh, so he you, studied... want to, you want to learn guitar now so come for that Let's see that's the start Fioki studied mechanical engineering at petroleum training institute in delta state Go and study, go and study law. Then they are going to be comedians. Go and study mechanical engineering. Then yes, they are, are strumming. The are you playing the guitar mechanically? The system actually <laughs> made us to be proactive. Ah. Yeah. This is proactive. Yes. I'm telling you. Welcome, Fioki. Good to have you with us. Same here. Okay, you got your name on your. Yeah, oh, the brand already is there. Too. Yeah. Guitar okay. at the middle, Fioki. So I'm trying to force guitar to be in the cap so that you can see it. <laughs> and hear it too. Now, you used to be in the church choir. That's where your music started. But is there, is there music in the family? How my did mom, you end up in the choir? My mom. I took it from my mom. She was in the women's choir. Do so, you have any other siblings who are in the choir? Or who were in the choir? Uh, my older brother was in the choir too. Mm. And he used to rap as well. Do you rap? He. My older brother used to rap. I don't rap. No, I said. I don't okay, rap. You don't rap. I don't rap. Okay. Mm. Um, now, you have this passion for the guitar. Your mother used to sing. She didn't play the guitar, did no, she? She never did. Where did that one come from? From me. <laughs> How so? <laughs> I started from. Uh, Church, like you said, like uh, when I was six, mm -hmm. uh, like you were singing. Yeah, on the children's choir then. Okay. From there, so that's where I learned how to sing soft annotation, soft family tila. So, so I never knew I was going to play instrument mm -hmm. then. So, after my SSC, you know, always waiting for jam to write jam. So I decided to look for something to do to be able to keep myself busy. So. I said, okay, you know what, let me pick instrument. I would have started with keyboard, but keyboard, you need to buy it, and it was expensive. The guitar was a box guitar, so you could just afford it. We wouldn't need to plug it to light. Are there it was any easy. guitars? Box guitar, box guitar. There's a box guitar that you can use to learn. So it's a, a bit cheaper. The one you made yourself or something? No, it's clear acoustic, acoustic, but in a local, we would say box guitar. So, so as I, then I met a taxi driver then, he I actually took, uh, rented the guitar then, so a taxi driver saw me with the guitar, I was passing, so he said, can I have the guitar, and I, I check it. So I gave it to him, the guy started playing, I said, okay, I found my teacher. So that's, uh, that's how we started, started learning from, from, from the guy. Thanks from to the play driver. the guitar from a taxi driver. Yeah. How incongruous. That was like 18 years ago. Does that taxi driver still play the guitar now? It's been long I saw him, I'm, so I'm trying to, I'm looking for him. You so, should stay in touch with yeah, him. Yeah. I saw him last, was like, that was like six years ago. Oh. So we used to learn from 8 p.m. to 9 to 10 p.m. to 2 hours. Every day? Every night for three months. Dedication. Then I stopped. So did, when you started playing the guitar, did that stop your singing? I already stopped. I already left my, my town for another town after my CC. So, so that means you left the church yeah, choir? Yeah, I left the church choir, but I was, I was now an instrumentalist. Not a singer anymore. A singer anymore. So I was now playing. What other instrument do you play besides that? I 
I, I've already re, I've written books on on bass. I play keyboard too. I play bass, play drums. I direct music. I used to direct mass choir too, as an instrumentalist. So the the journey has been crazy. <laughs> so you are a consummate instrumentalist. I'm telling you. Okay, what about the mechanical engineering part of your life? Okay, I actually did that because I wanted to go to school. I don't want to, I didn't want to say this one was happy, you know, go to school, now only music is happy play. But this is my passion. Yeah, I, my, my initial plan was to work in oil company because the school I went, I went for was Petroleum Training Institute. It's mm -hmm. a, mm -hmm. Most of my colleagues are working in oil companies. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So my plan was to work for 10 years, then resign come back to music and okay. invest in music. Mm -hmm. So I now applied for, uh, that was in Delta State. Now I applied for StarQuest 2008 reality show. So when I came to Lagos for the reality show, won the StarQuest, I said, oh, you know what? I came for a reality show and won it. So I think, let me just face my music. So that's how I took up. What, what, did, what did your parents have to say about all this? They, 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 they actually gave me the privilege to actually take my decision. I left them when, when I was 17. I was already on the street when I was 17, so the confidence was there already. They, they never had any bad news from me, so they, they knew I was good. And they are very proud now, because they are seeing the results. They are seeing, they are hearing news that, okay, their, their son is doing well. He's representing a quiet bomb too. Only news? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the apart news. from news. No, the news, okay. news is all around. They're seeing uh -huh. the paper. When they well, see the news, they see the They see the results. They feel, they feel, they feel the news. <laughs> 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 okay. Now, um, you said you won a reality show. Yeah. You, winner, winner, number one. Yeah. Okay. It was right. a talent hunt, 2008. Okay. Organized by Nigerian Brewers, Star. Star Quest. Star Quest. Yeah, so I wanted to take group, mm -hmm. to like a band set up. Okay. We had like the 36 people went into the house and, and formed six band. So my band came out the winner, 2008. So mm -hmm. from there, we, had, we were signed to Kenny's Music, then uh, joined the band 2010 after playing guitar on a track, skateboard by the band. Then I joined the band band, I played for the band for like four years, then joined Flavor 2014. So by, by, by then I've been playing on songs, different Nigerian hit songs back to back, from Woju, Dikizani, Olaye, Yemi Alade, Kissin, Take No Juro, Kiss Adeki, Adekunle Gold, Pick Up, Oriente, Simi, Love Don't Care, Smile, Jeremy, oh, I'm too many songs. Your yeah. signature guitar. That's the brand, Fioki. Once you hear this guitar sound on any secular music song, you just know that like 70% of the songs you hear out there are influenced by, by my guitar sound. That's it. I'm the, I am the spice of Nigerian music. I like that. I yeah. like it. I like yeah, that. Yeah, the music. This is a very confident young man. <laughs> very, very confident. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> how, how, how far do you want to take this? As, far, mean, as far as representing Africa worldwide. Who are those that you modeled yourself after? Actually, I never wanted to say I have a role model because I want people to see me as a role model. That's yeah, a, you can still be a role yeah, model. And I, I only really have, have influencers. Okay, so who are those uh, that influenced mm. you? George Benson, Norman Brown, Eklo. Mm. Just these three guys. And I didn't want to dwell too much on every, any, every, any other person because Norman Brown is more of a contemporary and a smooth guy. George Benson is everywhere. Uh, Clear is more of the classic. So I just needed three people, three uh, top guitarists worldwide so to be able to so listen. Did to you him. meet George Benson when he came to Nigeria? No, I didn't meet him. Did I only you? met uh, Richard Bonner, Gerald Albright, because we performed on the same uh, Smooth Jazz Festival, Smooth FM 2009. Okay. And so I performed there too on the Muson Jazz Festival. Did you think, did you ever consider um, the South American flavor to guitaring so that you'd have thought about people like, like Carlos Santana? Yeah. Yeah, that's especially for uh, the George Benson and others, they are jazz guitarists. Mm -hmm. Then Carlos Santana is in the hip hop platform, which is where I am. Me, to be very sincere with you, jazz, 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 you might appreciate it, but the new trend right now is Afrobeat, and I'm, not, I'm an Afrobeat guitarist, and that's what brings bar to me.